That's okay, boy, I'm maintaining my truth. Buddy, I go by the king of the sea when you see me, believe it. It's easy to see how I beat up a knock, I beat up a beat up a thousand episodes. Keeping a chain, my team is the lead, and the leader is me. What's good, everybody? My name is Austin Simon, aka Ace. I'm a rapper, slash teacher, slash dog dad, slash husband, slash geek. You already know what it is. You see the GD, you see the pops, you see the hydro flask. Hey, Gojo. Hey. So today we're going to be doing a reaction to the fine print, the Outer Worlds song by the Stupendium. So um, this song, after a while, has been requested the most. Um, there was a period of time where I got a whole bunch of different songs from the Stupendium that was, you know, requested in the comment sections of previous uh, Stupendium reactions, and I was like, I just, I, I, there's nothing that's consistently showing up. Um, and so I was just doing random ones until finally, it seems like now the fine print is starting to be, you know, recommended quite a bit. And so I'm like, all right, this is the one finally. <laughs> and, um, you know, I'm looking forward to this because this has been recommended so much now. And, um, you know, look, the stupidium, he, his videos are so fire. His rapping is so fire. His, his songs are, are usually really, really, really good. And so, you know, I, uh, I'm excited to hear what what this is all about. Um, real quick, if you would like to check out some of my music, there is a pinned comment that will take you to my most recent music video. Um, it's a nerdcore song, um, and it's 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 a banger. I can promise you that. But uh, yeah, let's do this, and we're gonna talk about it. Let's go. The stupendium. Y'all. I mean, look at this. This is fire. Welcome to space. Mm -hmm. What were you expecting? It's a dangerous place. Yeah. Thank you for investing. Go there for Welcome your rota. Welcome to space. What were you expecting? It's a dangerous place. Something investing. So A and then Esting as the rhyme scheme so far. Okay. Here is place. Thank you for investing. Go there yeah. for your rota. There for your borders. Yeah. Fill up these quotas. Yeah. We'll bill for your quarters. Report to your former. And, say, and he's still doing it, but so he's he has a uh, in this rhyme scheme, he has one in the middle and then one at the end. Um and they're both and they're both different, but he's he's keeping it consistent so far. This is high level writing, like this and all of this is intentional. Pay attention. We'll bill for your quarters, yeah. report to your foreman, but watch for marauders, cause if you get eaten, there's fees for your mourners. Prosperity's there in the care of magnates, and I'll say I'm heaven away. Did you okay. think it was supposed to look like the poster? It mostly does, oh, if you'd only read closer. Yeah. Just ten short years to a new frontier. Like, look at this, man. Dude. He's fire! Like, the fact he's able to do this, he does this! I keep telling y'all, he does this! This is him! He's making this video! The person is, you are defined as company property? Okay, and let's listen to actually what he's saying. Don't read the colony policy that defines you as company property. Oh. The waivers you're saying autonomy. Oh. The conglomerates got you in lock and key. Oh. We put the dollar back into idolatry. Yeah. If you're upset, you can rent an apology. We are a fan. You can rent an apology? What does that mean? I've never played this song. Or, I've never played this song. I'm playing the song right now. I've never played this game. Rent an apology? Is that like a thing? We put the dollar back into idolatry. If you're upset, you can rent an apology. Hey. We are a family forged in bureaucracy. No yeah. buying team, but there's common in economy. Mm, now nah, that's a bar. Hold on. There's no I in team, but there's con in economy. Oh, <laughs> uh, you can con people in this economy. There's so many ways to just do fraudulent shit in this economy there's so many ways to get over on people in this economy wow i love that i love that no buying team but there's calm in the economy were you expecting adventure were you hoping for fun yeah. my friend your intention and pleasures exempt from your tenure so venture back down to your slums provided a generous now 
I feel like in more recent videos, there weren't that many, uh, you know, I guess, uh, highlights from the actual game that he was rapping about. Um, or maybe I wasn't paying attention, but it seems like uh, obviously here there's a lot of highlights from the actual game. But I feel like in uh, in some of the recent ones that I've done, there weren't um, a whole lot of highlights, and it's just him. Hmm. Okay, so you earn the right to work to earn the right to work to earn the like yeah 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 that's that's clever that's clever that's clever okay 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 <laughs> Look, man, this is this is a direct like reference to to how things are right now. Like, not just in this game, in life, you work to earn the right to work, to earn the right to live, to purchase things, to earn the right to work. Like, it's it's all a vicious cycle, bruh. Dang. and then all that stress and then hey well you know in order to relieve that stress go to a retailer and you know contribute to the cycle even more by buying shit wow <laughs> By the way, his uh, accent changes here. That's sick. That's sick. And all the world to be explored, but our dreams are back on earth, and now the work is our reward. Yeah. And you'll be grateful for seats at the table, though it dips at one end and the bench is unstable. You may waste your days, but at least you were able yeah. to pay off your grave since we leased you your cradle. Be faithful uh. and pray, we'll repay what you invest, behave as you slave for humanity's interest. Yeah. On account that you're all on account, and we're quickly amounting humanity's interest. You think yeah. that we'd sink to the brink of rebellion with Mike is dependent on that. Look, this is not about the game. This is not about the game. This can't be. This can't be about just the game. Wow. This verse is crazy. This is a political song. Look, this isn't a, this is not his most this is not his most catchy hook, but I think it's his most impactful hook. I think it has the most meaning that I've heard from him. Um, even though it's it's repetitive, that's intentional. It's supposed to be repetitive. And it's it's supposed to drive home this meaning that we're working to earn the right to work more. <laughs> like basically. Dang. <laughs> Wait a minute. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. You can call that 
I wasn't gonna catch that. That's Dad Bull of Rusty though. <laughs> Lit cameo. <laughs> here. Welcome to the family. The Halcyon Holding Corporation thanks you for choosing the Stupendium as your Etherwave entertainment provider and also wishes to thank our esteemed Patreon investors. If you wow, 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 wow. Okay, so with Nerdcore, right, with, with Nerdcore songs, if you are a listener and you don't know the source material, then you can't, or at least for me, I can't help but then to try to relate the song to my own life, right? And and to me, a successful nerdcore song is a song that 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 does that. If it if it can really make you relate to your own life outside of the source material, then you have a really good nerdcore song on your hands. Because now, not just people that are a fan of the game or the show, now everybody can be a fan of the song, right? And so. Here, I have never played The Outer Worlds ever. I don't even, I've never even heard of that of that uh, game until today. Today, never heard of that game. Um, but I, all the stuff that he was talking about, like kind of relates to how labor is right now. You work to work and then you work more to work and then you can eventually buy things with what you've earned from working and that helps the people that are working in that job that you're buying the shit from and then eventually you're done. Like done, done, and that's, I mean, that's that's what he's talking about here. And then, like, you're just a cog in the system, kind of, and you know, your property of whatever overlying power that you know is is there. And I, I just like that's that's how labor is. That's and 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 that line. There's uh, no I in team, but there's con and economy. Oh, <laughs> like, bruh. Bruh, this was a, this song was not about the game. It couldn't have been. I don't, I've, I've never played the game, so I don't know. But man, like there was a lot of stuff there that made me think, like just about how things are just in general, and like it just made me think that it was like one of those kind of political songs. And yeah, I, I think that this was well put together. The video was fantastic. Um, I think that the uh, you know the the structure, I mean structurally, like from a technical standpoint. Goodness gracious, the rhyme schemes there were insane throughout. There, but that's the thing with Stupendium. His his rhyme schemes are always insane. Like, if you really like go in and like think and like really think, oh wow, how, like where he's put in the different rhyme schemes, it, it's so well put together. And you you, can, you can't do anything but marvel at how good this guy is, right? Um, and he wasn't even really rapping; he was singing. He was like rap singing, singing rapping. Um, and was still able to display his lyrical abilities. The hook here, I wouldn't say that it's his most melodic or hook. It's not his most catchy hook. It's definitely not his most catchy hook. But it's his most impactful hook and it has the most intention. And I think it has one of at least the best message I've heard um, from Stupendium because of the way that it was structured. The, you know, the you work to work to work and then, you know, building into to buy to uh to live like that whole that whole situation that whole like way that he set that up was was perfect genius actually like it was genius and so um i would say that yeah like i said this is probably his most impactful hook that he that he's made that i've heard so far um so i definitely understand why this was recommended so often um uh, in in the comments eventually because yeah, this this is this is one of those ones, and I, and I can assume that when it first came out, the people were like, "Wow." Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So yeah, overall the song was great, and I'm definitely looking forward to more Stupendium because I am thoroughly enter entertained every single time I watch one of his videos. So yeah, if you enjoyed this reaction, go on ahead and hit that subscribe button, turn that red thing gray. You already know what it is, and if you're a returning, thank you for returning and watching this with me. I enjoyed this, and I hope you enjoyed it as well. If you like rap. Nerdcore specifically, you can go down into the uh, pinned comment and it'll take you to my most recent music video, AMV. It's pretty dope, especially if you like anime. And um, yeah, see you guys next time. Bye.